And that was like, that was it. You know, so that year I closed the gallery later that year. And it was a perfect way to kind of close the whole, <laughs> the whole gallery thing because it was like, can't get better than that if you're talking about graph history, you know? Wow, definitely, bro. Incredible history. Thank you for sharing that. Uh, I want to backtrack a little to your STK days. At some point when you're writing for STK, doing your name, Man One, you kind of transition from your name to doing characters and faces. Can you tell us what influences you to to pursue a different path so the, or uh, add. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, so the characters, um, I started, I, I can't remember like my first characters, but I remember that I didn't want them to be B-boys. I didn't want them to be like New York style, you know. Um, what's his name? Mural was doing a lot of B-boys, you know. Dope in his own way. They were, he was doing them his own way, but he usually did a lot of B-boys. He also did other characters too, don't get me wrong. But he was also doing b-boys. Um, but I want to do something different. And I think Vile was the first one, like I, just, like I mentioned earlier. He's the one who showed me, like, oh, you could do this other kind of thing, you know? And so I started messing around with, like, doing different kinds of characters and, and stretching arms out and this and that. And then also at the time, um, well, a little bit later, um, I, I would say I got more into characters and really into developing my style once I got into COI. Once I got into COI, that's when like everything really changed for me in terms of like how I was going to be, you know, uh, changing my, my style, progression with my style, um, learning techniques, and then just the all out, you know, being on a different level uh, as a crew, you know, I think so that's, that's really what changed it for me. After you said, you mentioned you were in STK for about a year. Then you and Vile create a new crew, KMB, Killing Non-Believers. Why do you start this new crew? Can you please uh, go into that? Yeah, so we started that crew because, um, like I said, there was no reason for me to stay in STK anymore because Mural was, was locked up and I couldn't paint with him anymore. Um, and, you know, it kind of like fizzled out, you know. Like, like I said, I, I never... Even though I love tagging and bombing or whatever, like that wasn't what I wanted to do. Like I didn't see the future in that. I was like, this is fun for a night or two, but you know, in ten years, I don't want to be. I don't want to be still bombing and just tagging streets. I want to be doing you know burners. So uh, Vile was the one I was hanging out with the most. So me and him decided to start a crew. And so actually, the KMB original name came from Joe. Joe STK. He told me one time, he goes, dude, I thought of a cool name for a crew. And then he's like, it's called KMB, Killing Non-Believers. I'm like, damn, that's a fresh name. So I remember when I got out of the crew, I called Joe and I go, hey, is it cool if I use KMB? Because, like, we're going to start a little crew. He's like, yeah, you could use it. I'm not going to use it. So that's why we started. So, you know, thanks to Joe, SDK, that's how we got the name. Um, but, yeah, so KMB was like, a, we're exploring. We were like, let's do some out-of-the-box characters. Let's do some some just different styles that people haven't seen yet at least in our mind you know like i said we were young so would you consider k and b more of a piecing crew than a bombing crew both yeah definitely k and b was more of a piecing crew um some of the guys we got on the crew uh the great um we got in staff who used to be from uh, ska um who else was in there uh the homie fit um we did some bombing you know, we did some bombing, of course, like you had to, right? But we were really more like, how are we going to like hang around with more like piecers? And that's what we called each other, piecers, and get some styles down, you know? So we would do a lot of black book sessions and, and stuff like that. And then we'd definitely go paint. And we would paint all the time. But that, that crew lasted very, very short time. I mean, I don't know how long. I can't remember, but I would say like six months. For sure, not more than a year. Because by, uh, by 91 is when uh, we got into COI. 